like I've had some of the Cornish pass and I'm like, you're missing something. He goes, I know, shush. Yeah, yeah. Well, you know, you know the pasty, pasty shop down here, you know? I think it's owned by it. I don't know if the British guy or not, actually. Or, yeah, there's uh, just down here, but just further down, there's a Cornish pasty place. Oh, really? Yeah, you want to try it? Yeah, I think. Yeah. No, I, got, I like it. Um, I like their fish. Yeah. I like his mix. The, the, the chips aren't too. I agree with the fish. Is, no, I, no, no. GB fish and chips is yeah, good in yeah. some ways, but not in others. The well, chips I like are it. crap. I'm, I'm hilarious when I saw it. All right. Yeah, the I chips are crap at GB fish and chips. If you ask Alex, you know, who runs the places, he'll tell you that he, he knows it's not British chips. Oh, okay. He, he misses yeah. them. Yeah. Yeah. Misses but their shepherd's pie is good. Shepherd's pie. And oh the God, pasties I'll are good. I've had the shepherd's pie. Is okay, nice. I'll try it. It's, it's pretty good. But um, also the curry sauce. I don't know about town, but up north in our fish and chip shops, we always have curry sauce. Yeah. You know, you dip chips in it. Do they have the Do they have the curry sauce? He does, and when I okay. tried it, he, he, he does a really good job. It's just like just like it. It's a creamy chip. Yeah, no, it's a good curry sauce here. It's a typical fish and chip curry sauce. Yeah, yeah. yeah no, he's, he does he does a really good job. I, you know, I think that the whole chain is. Yeah, uh, yeah. I, like he said to me, he said, what do you honestly think? I said, look, I don't bring my father to many places. Yeah. Yeah. Well, especially up in Yorkshire, you know, we always consider ours to be the best, you know, whatever, the Yorkshire. <coughs> but, um, you know, we always, uh, no, you're, you're right, I'm not, <coughs> I like the fish, I'm not too keen on the, uh, on the chips. Okay. But, uh, I was really sad when I got rid of this wine, because that's used uh, Houston. What's that? Oh right, okay. The full yeah. is me. All yeah. oh, right. Yeah. I mean, I used to. See, I was. I used to not too far. So I was on the Colfax one. I used to near the, the Three Lions yeah. pub. So Jeremy, I think Jeremy, the guy from Birmingham who runs the place. Um, so I used to be in there quite a bit, watch a bit of football, not too much. But you know, she's going for lunch and curry and a pint of it. Because they do tetlers there. They do tetlers. They do tetlers. Is it clear? No, no, I think no, I think it's got really. Good, I think I think so. Oh yeah, yeah. Oh my goodness. But, but I thought there's one. Wait a minute. There's one of them. What other place has got tetlies on? Uh, well, I know that... Uh, oh, it's closed now. Uh, that one that opened up for a while, Churchill's. Oh, Churchill's. Churchill's, yeah. there we're by, you know, just going down to... Oh. Well, I know that you can get canned tetlies. Oh, yeah. Uh, you can get that from the uh, typical Baker Street. Oh, oh right. Baker oh. Street, yeah. Uh, I, oh. I don't know if they sell it at that, but yeah. Yeah, if you go to Colorado Mills, yeah. uh, the Baker Street bar. Gotcha. I know the one. I know, yeah. They've got oh. uh, tetlies in there, but it's just, it's just cans. And not, yeah. We're yeah. finding out where the good English food is in Colorado. Well, I said, it's definitely, it's definitely a hand-clad kettle. I'm fairly sure it is. Yeah. It's took my brother there. So when my brother came to town, he's a big, he's a kind of good old English beer. He's a great kettle. He's as well. Well, it is good. The problem is, is they're all bottles. Yeah, yeah. Bottles or cans. And I, I well, I'm not sure about that. I'm just sure if that's on tap as well. It's three lines. I'm not sure. Well, the you one, better have it on tap. The one thing sure. I miss, the one thing I always do when I go back home, the first thing oh. I do is go back to Johnson's. At Johnson's. Yeah, actually, because yeah, that, that's yeah, I don't, you know, I'm not, but I like a lot of the stouts, I like the IPAs and stuff yeah. like that, but the one well, thing I yeah, miss yeah. more than anything, because I get IPA here, yeah, I don't yeah, know. the other week again, IPA here, but I go straight home, and I, <laughs> Job my space. dad looks at me, because my dad's ex-army, I'm ex-navy, yeah. and the first thing he says, you can go to have a bar, he's like, I need a job, yeah. he's like, I got a couple of carrots in the fridge, I'm like, no, I need a draft. Yeah, yeah. We'll sit yeah. down and I'll have like one or two, one or two John Smiths and that'll make, oh. that'll make my evening and go to sleep for 12 hours. Well, the, the, the little place on here, there's a little um, beer and wine right about where we live. Yeah. And a um, small batch. It's got uh, Timothy Taylor's land. Oh. Timothy oh. Taylor's is popular. Isn't it? John Smith's got Timothy Taylor's up where I live. No. Sure. I bet make you laugh though when I say John Smith. John Smith, I know, yeah. Well, I, that's well, cool, especially when they do the widget inside. Yeah, yeah. Because yeah. I see the widget now in a lot of, lot of cans now. Yeah, Tilly's like, great. I know Tilly's a great. Yeah, I laughed to one of my buddies and I said to him, I said, if you don't understand where the widget came from, right? they're like, what are you talking about? It's always been, it's always been in, he said, it's always been in uh, course. And I went, no, no. It's, it originally came from John Smith. So it's, oh, a, it's, an original, it's an original thing. I said, it derived from France, yeah. but they didn't like it because they liked their bottle beer yeah, and not yeah, like yeah. cans. Yeah. And so Heineken started doing it. All right. And then, uh, and then it turned out, he said, no, it's because my buddy's a cause, uh, a big shot, of course. Yeah. And he said to me, this is what I told you that cause started off the music. <laughs> so this guy was adamant that it was cause. This time, actually, a lot of time I'm here. Uh, yeah, well, but yeah, you know, um, 
just because we live right there, so we're always at the coffee shop with, with the dogs. Typically in the afternoon, we're with my wife, she's not here to me, she's at horse riding. Um, but yeah, you know, the weather's nice, we're out here. Because yeah. I, I, I mean, I'm literally a new car since Down there? Yeah. Oh yeah, because I pop in there. Yeah, I mean, that's the one we use. Yeah. yeah. So I mean, if you see me around, uh, yeah. maybe, um, I mean, um, now I've got less and less hours. Yeah, Hogshead. Yeah. They have oh, music yeah. there too. <laughs> yes, I'll, I'll go, go down there because I don't know. Oh, 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 yeah, okay, then. Yeah. I should get oh, a number or something yeah, or whatever. Yeah, or... Yeah. yeah, I'll go get it from the other side. Oh, you know what? What the hell am I doing? I've got this technology. I've got my bloody phone. <laughs> you have a bloody phone. Here's the pepper. 303. Right, unless I can like, go through it. Uh... Well, we're, we're uh, you're Apple. I'll, I'll, I'll just stick it on. I'll just stick it in my notes. I'm Ladies and gentlemen, this is the English meetup. <laughs> Okay, so it's uh, 303. Oops. 947. Uh, 947. 